Well, this is the one we're scheduled to stream right here. This young man coming a long way, being picked up by Predator. Um, young kid, You're in too. for a he's treat. He's young, ain't he? Yeah, you're in for a treat. Uh, once again, folks, you are watching the Pro-Am 10-Ball Tournament uh, from US-1 Billiards and Bar. Jason Shore and ours pool room here in uh, West Haven, Connecticut. I'm upstate Al of AZB TV. In the booth, we have Mr. and the only Mr. That's in the booth right now with me is Mr. Ed Cohane, Eddie the Lock. How are you, sir? It's fun being here. Beats sitting home, don't it? Yes, sir. There's uh, <laughs> a safety play right here. Send him up to the top rail. Oh, nice. What a nice touch right there. And we are in progress with this match. Uh, it's Joe Korsiak and Jesus Atenzio. Left him with a two-reel kick here. Notice it is a race to eight, so it is a B-side match. The eliminator, the uh, loser will be eliminated here. And I'm expecting another great match right here out of these two. Good hit. He hit it. He did just hit it. Took the paint off a little bit. He tried to call it. He was calling a three on that just in case, but now it's not looking good because he's got a great shot on his two ball right here. The four doesn't go by the eight, and, but he can roll up on the three and and played in, in the opposite corner on the right. Jesus is in pretty good shape here. Oh, they're seeing parts of Gary's table over there, Al. Can you uh, swing the table? Can you swing the camera for that left table? People are asking a little bit if it's going to interfere at all, but uh, people are asking about Gary's game, and you know, right over here. I don't know if you that, can That's not a match. Oh, oh, that's on the tight pocket. That's that, right. They must Sorry. be playing some one pocket or something on the tight box. That's yes. not a match in the tournament. Sorry, folks. It's that's only a, action. Yeah, that's a triple shim table for one yeah. pocket, right? Very tight. Oh, that almost got him. Somebody asked if that was a good hit by Joe. Yeah, he feathered the two prior to hitting the eight. Yeah, it was. Yeah, he just caught it. I believe that was, uh, man, who was that to ask that question? Amanda Andres, yeah. Hey, Amanda Andres. Miss you, kiddo. Don't mind me, I'm a little bit, uh, I just went outside smoke a cigarette which is my bad habit and the snow is on it, it's got to be about five inches deep it's coming <laughs> still coming down like crazy <laughs> Troy's relentless all right and i don't like him using my words with sparky and things like that all right you're handing out all my lines out what happened here uh did uh jesus play a safe or oh he must have got himself in that jam and he's you, you know i'm gonna jump over part of the nine or something I caught. I, I I seen that that nine roll out. I didn't think he got that bad. I thought he had it from the other angle. I he guess called got, the upper left hand corner here. Yeah, he's got it. He has to jump the edge of the nine ball to, to make it though. That's why he's got his jump cue out here. Right. He doesn't have to jump the whole ball. But if, if he happens to come up short on this shot here, the cue ball will squirt behind the uh, seven eight there. Yeah, yeah. Two way and, shot maybe. Yeah, and the full but, ball will come down the other side. But then if he makes the ball, then he's really stuck. Well, depends on where the cue ball lies. Yeah, he, he's, he's trying to stick the rock, come to the rail and back out. Watch this shot. He played it like absolutely the nuts. Wow. Rail right back out. If he's got vision on this, he came up with a magnificent shot. Well, he, It looks like he does. And now he's got the five to the six problem, and that's a big problem from here. Well, he's, the seven ball is also a problem as far as bridging over it. I mean, right. It might, well, half a bridge, right? He's probably got... Yeah, he's not really way over it, but yeah, he's up. This is tough. He may end up with a bank on the six ball. Uh, he's got to pocket this five ball before he can get to the six ball. You know what? You this know what guy, this guy's got the kind of stroke. He'll draw back on this ball and stop on the ten and play the seven. How would that be? That'd be something to watch, wouldn't it? Back to back. They draw this up. He he might have to spin this a little bit. Can you draw this up and hit it that good down the roof like that? That's what he did. What a shot. Man. 
That's vicious. I tell you, we're in for another great <laughs> match here. <laughs> that was beautiful. I want to say hello to the manager down there from Steinway Billiards, my man, Jose Cruz. Well, Joey's in for a tough time here if he, he can do stuff like that because that was, that was that'll get your attention real quick. Look at how look at how perfect he's playing uh, ball in hand position almost every shot here now. Look at this, he's going to get a. I missed that. I thought he was. Just to bring you up to date, I mean this match just started. Uh, the next match here will be Mike DeShane and Jason Shaw. On the winner's side, this is a B side match. It's a race to eight. The winner's side matches are races to nine. Um, I don't know if Jason is watching. Uh, Jason was shoveling some snow outside. I mean, it, it, Jason's like uh, an all-around cook, this, clean bee. He's buzzing around the pool room doing his duties and playing in the tournament. And how do you stay in stroke like that? <laughs> this, uh, you got a uh, John Freeman here wants some information about your camera, if you can help him out. Hey, Troy, it's I, a I posted the uh, pictures with Alan, and I think he posted them, but on my camera, it's very clear. I don't know why you guys can't see the bracket. And I'll send them to your phone if you want, and you can put them up there. But they look real clear on my phone. It's, you guys are having trouble with it. It's, it's not my fault. It's my flip phone. <laughs> You're good. They're Canon cameras. Oh, that's what I'm using. What was he looking at there? Want to say hello to Tara, who happens to be watching. Look at this. Dead punch. He's in dead punch. Dead uh, punch. Uh, uh, uh. Mm. You just don't hit it any sweeter than that. Yeah, he'd like to be up about two more diamonds. Well, yeah, close to yeah. better. But, you know, yeah. the shots that he just made, I think, are more than impressive. And I favor him to make the shot, and all he has to do is roll it. Yeah, yeah. Just cinch it. You're good. Yeah. Yes. Oh, you see, Upstate, yeah. can, upstate can get the you, best of you're them. You're a jinx, bro. You're not kidding. <laughs> Satch Mahoney got nothing on me. <laughs> well, Joey's got to be happy about that. You can get out front here with an early lead on one nothing, and uh, break the ice, and, and he's got no give up in him, you know? Never had. None. I got a chance to talk with Joe. Uh, <laughs> Joe said a little respect here. And uh, Sue says no. <laughs> Joe, we actually asked him to give him the 10 ball. <laughs> Not a bad move. <laughs> yeah. Not yeah. A bad move. I saw that. <laughs> <laughs> God bless them all. All right, Joey. Broke the ice. I'm glad we're having some fun here. Okay, 1-0. And race to eight. I got a chance to talk to Joey outside uh, Dornum five-minute break that I took. And Joey said, oh, I'm so sorry I shot so bad. I said, no, Joe. You got four mistakes. That's, yeah, right. And probably the whole match. He but, said, oh, that's too many mistakes. I said, yeah, I know it's too many mistakes. I said, but two of them happened within the first rack. And that's why he jumped up ahead of you. You know, it's almost a, uh, an unwritten rule that a mistake's going to cost you two games, right? Would yeah. you say? You know, yeah. all the time. Kinky always used to say, two mistakes in a race to nine is too many. Oh, yeah. I, I constantly repeat that. I'll never forget it. Yeah, and you, know, you, and you recognize it when you're sitting in your chair after doing it, too. You, you don't forget it. Yeah, Jack, uh, I, I got to agree with you, but I, I've only seen this kid a little bit, uh, this Jesus kid, but... Uh, he was doing things before in practice and very impressive stroke, you know. And and, and he's got that youth thing going. I want to say a big shout out to Isaac Horn for your generous donation. Thank you very much. That's much appreciated. And it's gonna to go to good use. Goes to all tour gear. That's where it goes. Right to the right to the gear. That Thank was, you so much for your support. That was Reggie Cutler there, uh, Vince. Uh, Reggie's a big one pocket guy. You know Reggie, I think. All right, let's watch Joey. Joey's not happy with his break. 
He did tell me that. Let's see if he can stop the rock here. You know, he, Whoa. Went, he went dead center on that. It looked like a you know, four ball. He hit that 10 ball rack like a nine ball rack. He's got no shot on the one. Oh, this is a tough push. This is a real tough push here. Uh, I guess you got to send it up behind the eight because there's no side pocket for the bank. Yeah, you really don't want to leave a window. Not yeah. too much. There might be a window for that side past the five, but I wouldn't. I don't know. You know what? Joey's going to get hurt. If he sends it up behind the eight, uh, then he'll just send the cue ball down to the three and leave the one up there behind the two and the eight stuff also. You're asking a lot because the one has to get out of there too. Yeah, he, yeah, he mean, could hit the eight and leave a shot. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. This is a tough push. He's contemplating. You know what? If if he can right here tie something up somewhere. Well, it looks like the only pocket open, if you bring him all the way up table, is a side pocket and there's traffic there. Yeah, I, I like that. I really like that. See, do you see where the seven and the, the five, I believe it is, and the two are? That kind of causes havoc if you're going to try to go for this bank it does go yeah but you know those balls right there come into effect when these pockets are only that big well you, you know you that, really got to hit it precise but that five does make that po I, that pocket a little bigger too though a little I, bit not much i like him playing safe and putting a rock behind the six ball there or that's right next to this one uh but if he you know if he feels good or you know, or, or you he's know, or gonna that. go for it if he feels good See that three? Come, oh, oh boy, he, he got the best of it. Pretty smart shot. Pretty yeah. smart shot. Does he have a real first here? I mean, just for the hit. And if he does have a real first, he could send the one right down to the three and lock it up. And and uh, but then he'll leave him with a bank cross side. Hey, I'll get a new partner on your booth, please. That guy makes sure awesome Yeah, Fern job Fern like Fernando that. was going to call me. I was going to tell him hello this nah, morning. Come on, don't. Oh, you know him? No, I don't know. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> uh, come on. I asked him to call me before. This is his second comment. Come on. Yeah, no. I, I feel the enthusiasm at Eddie. He, he happens to be a real good friend of mine. And uh, the door's always open, Fred. I know a lot of people have their opinions, and they got them about me, too. I have several about you, Al. That's all right. Here we go. Let's kick this. Here's a safety. That was an automatic. Hey, Roy, thank you for your uh, support. I did get your uh, donation. Thanks, Roy. Here's the kicking uh, game that I like. You know, kick with a purpose, I always say. Kick safe, in other words. Ed, can you move that water bottle from the screen? Oh, sure. I'm so sorry. I can see it. Yeah, yeah. Nice kick. How did he kick with the spin? Ooh, put him on. No. Well, gave him a 1-5, one, 1-3 one, combo if he wants it. That's shootable. Somebody, who was it? I think it was, I don't know if it was Hopkins. I was talking to somebody within the last couple of months, one of the top pros on the phone. And they said, you know what made Efren Reyes so great when he came over was he was kicking a shot. In other words, whether he was kicking a shot to play safe or he was kicking a shot to make the ball, that was really what made him shine. You know, a lot of the other pros realized that th this guy, Efren, is kicking a shot. He's kicking to play you safe or he's kicking to make the ball. He's not just kicking to hit the ball. I think it was Johnny Arch I was talking to about that. And then all of a sudden, you know, all the top pros started practicing kicking with kick, a purpose. Kick safes and then, oh, sure. Yeah. And, and Efren, Ef was, Ef Efren brought that to light. He's a monster at it. Yeah. A, God uh, bless him. Jesus just got uh, robbed on that combo because he doesn't have a, a shot on the one, just a safety play here. Oh, look at this. Oh, boy. He, well, he left him an edge. But he did fire on, on that 1 3 combo and he made a look up, but then that one snuck up behind the 8 and locked him up. You know, you, know, you saw, you saw uh, Efren do that in Pat's Make It Happen thing a few times, you know? And, or, or oh, 
Oh, he tried to. You know what? He tried to rail first. That. Yeah, Talking was, about Mr. Fleming. That was. I want to say uh, hello to Mr. Patrick Fleming, and uh, we wish Patrick all the well that it could be gathered. And uh, keep an eye on uh, Patrick Fleming at AccuStats.com. Uh, he's got all his uh, DVDs and online matches from yesteryears that are just gems. Uh, and and walls of it. I, yeah. The walls are, like, covered. You know, he's got more matches than anybody in the world. AccuStats.com, folks. Petey might be in the chat, is he? Troy, did you see Petey in there? Petey's a good man. I love Petey. Matt Tetro, how you doing, buddy? Hey, Matt. There's another guy we ain't seen in a long time, right? That's his last year at Providence. Yeah. That was about the start of the virus time. I got to mention uh, the Q repair man here that's on premises asked me to give him a shout out on the air, and I had a business card, and I love doing it. And the business card's in my jacket, of course, which I... Oh, my jacket's right beside me. Okay, so I can still get it. Uh, let's see. All right, here it is. Let's give him a shout-out here. Nick Marinos, he's here on premises. Shafts and Q repairs. Brian Tierney. There you go. How you doing, mister? Hope the family's well. You can get in touch with uh, Nick at... Oh, boy, this car. Let's talk back here. Nick got... <laughs> <laughs> Troy is just bombing me out. Right, you, can get, you can get in touch with Nick at uh, nick.marino3183 at gmail.com. Or I guess you can call the room and... Uh, Get in touch with him if you're in the local area and you need uh, any repairs done. I told him I'd give him a shout out. There you go. I did it. Hey, Lisa Jean. Hi. How are you? Welcome to the stream. Okay. That's okay, uh, Andrea from Utica Billiards. It's always a pleasure to see as Asus did something happen ties it up 1 1. John Freeman, you're asking about Pat Fleming, I believe. I guess. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, Pat lost his son about a month ago, uh, and uh, uh, the pool world is uh, Pat's se okay. Sent, sent a lot of condolences and and uh, the whole pool, you know, on AZ and everything, and Facebook, and uh, it was a tough time. And uh, he's got a hard road ahead of him, but uh, he's hanging in and he's back to work and he's he's uh, doing what he does. I'm, that's that's all I'm going with. But a good man. Him and his wife are very good friends. Yes, he is. Yeah, tragic event in the family. That's all. All right. Okay. Uh, Thanks for asking. Let's see the break here now. It's 1-1. One, one. We're tied. Frank Chitani. Frank Chitani. Hey, bro. Yeah, you know, Frank, be happy you're not here now because it's snowing like hell out. <laughs> um, it, Al's trapped me. Nice break. Cue ball. Oh, yeah. Oh, he got it. He pocketed the nine ball in the left side pocket. Let's take a look at the other angle, see if he's got this shot. He might not have this in the corner pocket. He might have to rub the rail or elect to play safe right from here. He'll have a good safety if he does it. If he does. Well, but look at this layout. If he does have it, he'll fall on the two real good here. This is a layout you want to wake up to every day. Yeah. You know, he does if, have it. If he can get to one ball yeah. and make it. Wow. Yeah, he's got that. He's going to fall on a two perfect. All right. He's got the shot. Tied at one. Stay in the middle of the table and just come down. 
baby, the left oh, side. Yeah, I see. Look at that. It looked like he had to rub the rail Maybe a had little to bit. Cheat a little bit. Huh? Yeah. Sometimes you know, with the new cloth, it'll you know it'll slide in, but uh, maybe it's a little bit worn now. George Texter out there in Africa. Hey, George. What's up, Nick? How you doing? You know, I know you guys in here to watch this and be happy because I don't know what the roads are like out there, but it, it was coming down like there's no tomorrow. It's it's about uh, two inches an hour coming down out there. You know, it's that heavy. Nice touch. Oh, oh the seven got him. We might have a rail first shot here. Yeah. If not the shot itself. Yeah. Oh. yeah. I, I don't think there's really that much of a reason to really become a conductor like, you know, yeah, an he, orchestra conductor, wave your hands. I think he can make this. Now, what does he got next? Do we have uh, the fours right down here on the right? Well, he might want the perfect rail first shot here, but he's mm -hmm. got to watch the speed. Yeah, that was that was. Just, he needs he needs this six ball to block him right here. Did he get it? No, he did not. Well, you're gonna you might see some pool right here. The three to the four, and then the four to the five. This is key right here. This shot. Thank you, Nick, for the kind words. Hey, Katie. Tommy Jr.'s oh. wife is in the chat. Off the rail. She, you know, we should have had Katie in the booth. I'm sorry. You know, Katie, I'm real, I have to really apologize because she's got so much knowledge of the game. Uh, well, well, we, we were talking about, I we see. were talking about a, a match. And just from the blue, she started calling the shots like right, right on, like spot. Next time you got to get in the booth, Katie. You know, um, that was um, Bob Lewis. Even heavier now in Southeast Connecticut. Isn't that where I am? Isn't West Haven, uh, Southeast Connecticut? Or New Google Haven? Map it. Do you know how yeah, to do yeah, that? We don't, you, you look, this is your neighborhood, bro. You know this area. You're from the Bronx. You can almost see the Bronx. Hey, from Nick. Here. I, I got some good responses uh, when I gave you a shout out. People were saying he's a real nice guy and stuff, and good man. Yeah. You're quite welcome. Anytime. I'm glad, I'm glad to help. Yeah, Katie. I think you, I, and Tom have to get in the booth, or just you and Tom would be great. You know, I, I was actually telling uh, Nick here, uh, I was telling Nick to get in the booth with us um, so he can talk about, you know, his cue repairs and what he does. And uh, he said, oh, I'm not a talker. And, and believe it or not, just through experience, some people that say that to me uh, really are the ones that really come across real nice. I always tell them whether they're shy or they just they say they're not talkers or the ones that are real peppy and happy. I always just tell them to calm down and be yourself. I try to drill it into Eddie. He, he is himself. <laughs> you are hearing Eddie just the way he is in normal life. <laughs> He's ready to cut me. <laughs> no, that wasn't for you. That was for him. <laughs> oh, okay. I got help over here, right? He, he's going to cut you, too. Cliff, Cliff Tyler. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, my nice guy. One of the good guys. He says uh, yeah. Nick is a great guy. Says you take care of everybody up here. Nice work, bro. Yeah, take care of everybody. Nice in, uh, Massachusetts. Good for you. Put him on the air. Get Nick a headset. Here you go, mister. Get on it. Oh, Talk with us for a few. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, yeah, you got it. I'm going to knock this over. Okay. Here, bro. Tell me when you're comfortable. Just get comfortable. Here's the break. Uh, One second, Eddie. That's okay. Hey, Suze came One up. second, Eddie. Go ahead. Hey, Nick Marino. Welcome aboard. Thank you for having me. Oh, anytime, man. Okay, so we uh, I told everybody how to get in touch with you. I told them you're stationed here. But I don't know if you're stationed here all the time. N or do you move around? Are you mobile? Or? Most of the time I'm at the tournament center up at Snaps. In uh, East Windsor. Okay. And then uh, I also do pool, pool repair down at um, the Old Billiards. Okay. That yeah. Bobby Hilton's Yeah, room? Bobby Hilton's pool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All the guys, um, we all grew up together. 
Okay. So Actually, you're, you're doing something like what uh, Teddy Harris used to do. You know Teddy Harris? No, I don't. No, but yeah. Well, you know Mike Webb, I'm sure. Yeah, sure. Well, how they used to be mobile and they'd go to tournaments yes. and set up. So, like, if somebody's having a tournament and they wanted a Q repair oh. guy, because I've been in places yeah. uh, where pool room owners or tournament directors wanted to have a Q repair guy on premises, but they yeah. didn't know where to go sure, or who to reach out to. So are you mobile with, like, a trailer yes. and stuff? Oh, you are? Yes. Okay. And how do, how do people get in touch with you? Um, most of the people, because I'm involved in the APA a lot with Bruce. and um, It's a good way know, to go. Yeah, it's great. You know, you have got 30,000 people. I, you know, they follow me all the time. And it's actually pretty good. And um, I'm in the pool hall all the time. Yeah, no, but how do people get in touch? With, uh, like, are you on they, Facebook? Yes, I'm on Facebook. Facebook is really... I under need, your name? Yeah, it's under the APA website, the APA uh, League. Yeah, that really helps me a lot. Yeah. And, um, and the pool halls. I know most of the people in the pool halls. Um, Phil Davis, you know. You, oh, yeah. oh, Phil Davis. Yeah, good friend of mine. Good, I, good, good I like kid, Phil. Phil. Good I, took, kid. I took Phil to uh, Vegas for the first time when he was 17. Oh, Did yeah. you really? Yeah, yeah. So you set the hooks in him, huh? Oh, yeah, I, I heard. I, I, I'm sorry. He played. On, he played on my team, so <laughs> it was weird. So I like Phil. He's a good. kid. I was talking to Tommy Junior uh, yeah, yesterday, and Tommy friend. said, "Well, that same thing happened to Phil. Yeah, like he came in here and he was practicing in here a long time ago, yes. and he uh, well, he came into shoot pool, and ever since then he was hooked. Yes, yeah. once once yeah. you start playing pool, then you're done. You know, this is <laughs> Phil's neighborhood. How come he's not here? He's, he's working. He's, yeah, a, he's a nurse. Yeah, he's a oh, nurse. Oh, and he's, uh, good for him. And God got, bless him. He's Big got shout a girlfriend out to him. now. Yeah, but it, actually, they won, they won the, the team events. He got married. Didn't they get married? Yes. 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 Yeah, they won't make mistakes. They, they won the yeah. team events. <laughs> I, I warned them about it. I, I told them to run. I tried so, to help them. <laughs> so, Nick, getting back to you, yeah. yep. they can get in touch with you on Facebook. On Facebook, yeah. Or uh, you have a phone number or anything yes. like that? Uh, y yes. Um, uh if they want to, they can call me. It's a uh, six zero six nine zero three one eight three. And uh, I got your email. I spit your email. Yeah. I, I could be a rapper. Like I can spit things out. I know you're good. You're yeah, good. I try. I'm, no, I'm not that I'm good. Just, don't pump me up. Don't don't, <laughs> don't, don't, don't go there. Okay. <laughs> it's Nick dot Marino three one eight three at gmail dot com. Yes. And his phone number is eight six zero six nine zero thirty one eighty three. So if you need a Q stick repair guy. I also do, do pool tables. I was just going to bring that in, but go ahead. It's free plug for you. Go ahead. No, 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 no do it, man. Take, I don't want to take your you, spot. No, no, <laughs> you're not taking my spot, man. I, listen, <laughs> let, I'll tell you something. Anybody that's in the industry, yeah, that I can help out in any way, you're and, great. And, and I don't tap myself on the shoulder for believe me, I, I don't have a big head. I'm willing to help out. Yeah, and well, you say you repair. Pool tables, install yeah. them, the yeah. whole nine yards, yeah. and they get in touch with you right off the number that Gmail. Yes. Or come to the pool room where you might sure. be and set up an appointment with Text you. Text me, call me, whatever. There you go. I'm willing to. I did probably a couple hundred tables just this year alone. Good for you. Because everybody, everybody's stuck home. It's hard work. Good for you. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, 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 everybody was stuck home. So yeah. we go. I was yeah. happy to have a table at my place. I'm not yeah. kidding. Yeah, it's nothing like you it. You could lose your mind if you can't play for a year like this. I don't know what some of these guys do. Yeah. You know? And we'll tr uh, we'll try to help you out, too. You know, when my kid always signs up on your sites. You know, oh, we, all, we always jump, that. We always jump in. We always share your stuff. Thank you. you. Yeah. I like it's, when people share things. It's that great. Makes, that it's makes great. a big difference. It helps in a big way. And it only takes a second. You know what I mean? So I really appreciate that. Yeah, Thank but, you so much. But it's awesome. I mean, even when I come into the pool halls, I try to spend some money to support the pool halls, you know. It's worst places to be. Yeah. You know, it's like uh, every time I come here, I make sure that when I'm out of here, I, I support the pool room, you know. And Jason, it's, can't yeah. ask for a better guy. Who's that anyway? <laughs> <laughs> he is, you know. Thanks, Jay. I remember when he, Jason first started coming around. I, yeah. I, I looked at the way he was shooting. I said, I don't know who this kid is yet. Wasn't it something? Yeah. I said, but this kid's going to be a world champ. Yeah. Man. Yeah. I'm, yeah. Hoping, I'm hoping Lucas gets up to that point someday. Lucas mm -hmm. is on the right path. I spoke to him last night, and he, and he actually, after a, the advice I gave him, he looked. His father came to pick him up. Dave came. And... Uh, he said, did you hear what Upstate just said? Because Lucas actually told us far a little about it, you know. Yeah. And basically it was just what I say about a lot of young players is you can play here for 10 years and yeah. you're playing the same people. Uh, That's, my that's your boy? That's my boy. That's your boy. He said hello. <laughs> sorry, I didn't mean, I didn't mean to. I'm no, sorry. that's quite yeah. all right. Yeah. Uh, so 
you really got to step out of the realm yes. and start swimming with the bigger guys or the bigger gals. And it's easier said than done, you know, because, yes. you know, guys like Mike Davis and his family, they put money together and they, they supported him and they traveled on his dime. Sure. You know, you didn't have sponsors. Oh, yeah, it's not easy. And, and it's so hard. I mean, he's such a great junior player. Yep. That he needs somebody, and it's easier said than done. I could spit it out. If there's somebody out there that can sponsor him to... In other words, I know sponsors that sponsored players, just for an example. They gave him travel expenses, no matter where the tournament was. If they had a flight, they, they flew him. They fed him, and they roomed him. Sure, you have to. So now when you're on location at this tournament, yep. getting that support from a sponsor... Yep. You're walking in a pool room like you're just practicing. Sure. You're not going in there with the, sh the th train of thought in your head that you have to, well, I just spent 2000 I got to come in, and then you go to the chart and the payouts, and I got to come in third, fourth, or fifth, or somewhere, depending on how big the... Just now, to pay my heat. bill. That's yeah. pressure. Just to pay the bill. That's pressure. Yes. When you have all that help from a sponsor, man, you're, you're freewheeling. Yes. You know, and he's got a game. He's got a game... That's gonna flourish if if he can find a sponsor, and he's a very polite young man. He is. Oh. He is. You know, he's still a little young. I mean, he's not that young, but he's young enough. And uh, we try to help him. We put him in a couple games here, and he did good. You know. Yeah. So he's just gotta. And uh, you know something? I totally disagree with all that. Putting him in action in it's big action matches, okay. playing you know Reyes or whatever. Yeah. I totally disagree with it. I, think oh, he. I, I know it, it. It seasons. It was him. just an experience, yeah, for him. It seasons him for uh, challenge matches. Yeah, yeah. But I think it it takes the concentration away from the practice. You know his drills and stuff. Yes. Maybe I'm wrong. I could be wrong. You know. I know well, a lot of players that had to be in action in the beginning to yeah, get seasons. Yeah, you don't have to because a lot of the, there's a lot of pros that were never in action. They just made it to the pros, you know. And, it's and I respect that in a yeah. big way. Trust yeah. me. I think I think uh, like any other sport, uh, there has to be role models, nice shot. you know. And, and then when you hear, as soon as you hear Jordan was gambling, placing bets all over, or who, Barkley, or well, you name it, so, you know. The, the media picks up on it. It's, it's a different. It's different. like it's like a black eye. Yes. Yes. You know that stigma. Yes. You're right. And uh, that's, you know, he, Phil Davis, um, Dave Garish, and Rob Pearson, and also Bobby Hilton. They're the ones that really brought Lucas up to where he's at. You know. Yeah. They used to spend a lot of time in that pool hall to like four or five o'clock in the morning. Right. Practicing all the time, challenging each other. You know, but you're right. The gambling is, the rambling is, is it's an excitement, but it, it does give you a black eye. Yeah. Joey K with a good out. This is not nice. the correct score now. These guys are What do you great. mean it's not the correct At score? At three to two, I don't think it's three to two right now. I think it could be three to three. We missed something while we were talking. I'm Why, you see the coins? Uh, I can't see it. I don't think there's coins. So what are you guessing? Yeah, there's coins on I'm, there. I'm pretty sure. I let got me, two on that side. Let me find out what the oh, coins are. Oh, there is coins. Okay. Back. Oh, yeah. okay. There's one. Um, I got three to two. Uh, if I made a mistake, then it's on. Yeah, I think while we were talking, we snoozed one of them. Let me find out what the score is. No, no, relax, relax. You got it? We'll Mike's see if he, we'll see what he does with this coin in, uh, because I think it is three two. Yeah. Please. I, I think we missed one game. That's what I'm saying. You know. These maybe, guys, these maybe, guys are incredible, man. Oh, well, chat. Mark, Mark Delisle's, Delisle's saying it's three to two. Watching these guys play is just like unbelievable. The way they control that ball. Yeah, you know what? Joey just had a good out right there. Did he? And uh, we yeah. were bullshit. I know. <laughs> it was so, and, and it was really good, you know. Oh, he, my God. He, you know, he, he's, he's, he's getting his uh, rhythm here. Thank so, you, Bill Cody. Yeah, and Hazel's, man, that, I love that oh, stroke. Oh, yeah, my he's God. playing real good, too. I can't believe the way that he just – the way he just stops that ball and controls that yeah, ball is just yeah. sick. Just to bring you up to date, Miguel LeBoy and uh, Kang Lee are still locked horns in that match. That's a long match. I Over here, you. right? Yeah. Oh, Joey scratched, but he made the ball. Oh, what a great break, too. This is not good. This is, look at this layout. Yeah, you can't scratch in this no, game. Not no, against no. these guys. You, you hope there's something tied up after you're oh done, but not, this is wide open. Well, that's why. Sometimes I don't understand why people have to smash the hell out of that ball that hard. Well, a 10-ball break, I think uh, Shane Van Boning's probably got the best break in 10-ball in America. Yeah. 
I think he hits him about medium, medium hard. 24 miles an hour, I want to say. But <laughs> it, it, it's all in his – he doesn't – it, it, it's already muscle memory. Yeah, yeah. He knows yeah, what he yeah. knows. Yeah, but you have to control that cue ball. It's just, you know. Well, he's always dressing the one ball up for the upper corner. <laughs> it's just incredible. And Jason does the same thing. Yes, yes. A lot of, a lot of people do. It's funny. You don't, a lot of people, like, like lower, uh, lower, lower players, they don't see all that. They don't, yeah. How the hell does he do it? How does he end up there all the time? Well, that's how you do it. You play a lot of pool. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, that didn't happen overnight. No, no. I think Shane, uh, as far as I know and as far as I've seen, happens to be one of the people that practices the most I've ever seen in my life. It's crazy. In my crazy. life. Crazy. Well, I tell people all the time because I play a lot of people and they, you know, they like they get mad. And it's like I say, how, many, how much time do you really spend playing pool? It goes, I only come out a couple of times a week. Well, well that's what you're going to get. Yeah, right. You're going to get yeah, a couple, right. you know, you go to work, you work eight hours a day and you become good at work. You know, so if you want to play pool, you're going to have to, you have to practice, you know. It's a lot of practice. These guys, I'm sure these guys, they eat, sleep, and they just, that's all they think about is pool, pool, pool. That's where, why they're where, so good. Where's Jesus from? Do you know he's Puerto Rico? No, I don't know where he's from. I Somebody's just saw, asking right I now. I saw him here for the first time. Yeah. Uh, so I, I just I just love the, his everything about him, just like the way he stands, the way he plays, his demeanor everything's perfect yeah I, I think it's puerto rico because uh i thought he was here with someone else from there so yeah that's awesome i good thought i heard him. it yesterday so good for him good for him i mean he's look how solid he is he's just oh yeah and the cue ball control is just incredible yeah he did a couple of things before that were very impressive. yeah right the draw shot over the ball i was wow yes you don't want to shoot it you don't you just want to cinch it it, it was so difficult and he nailed it oh, my god Nice to see that come around. People do, doing that kind of stuff. And, he's you know. just real smooth. Yeah, you know, he's not sure. nothing crazy. Right. Perfect shot. Nice. I think I'm gonna end up being Al's partner from now on. Welcome aboard, <laughs> sir. <laughs> no, just mess. <laughs> The door's always open. <laughs> you know, you don't see a door on this look booth. At, look at that stuff. That's oh, crazy. there you go, uh, Robert Car Car I'm glad, you, I'm glad you're having a good time. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate uh, it. It's an honor to have you. Jesus is from uh, Venezuela. Venezuela. That's a, it's just. That's close to Puerto Rico, right? Yes, yeah. it's close enough. About a thousand miles away. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, sir. Yeah, that, I, I'm surprised he's got the head. I was warm down there. Oh, you yeah, know why he's probably cold. Yeah, absolutely. He's probably did, cold. Did you, look, did you look out the front door? I don't want to look out the front <laughs> door right now. I don't, I'm not going. I'm going to wait until the end of the day. It's going to be ugly. Yeah, we wait until the end of the day, and then we'll look out the door. 4-2 in a race to eight, folks. If we don't, we'll, we'll end up sleeping on these church chairs. No, we'll be fine. Can't wait for the finals. That's going to be crazy. Yeah, Marty Herman, that's probably true with the way that government went to hell down there. A lot of people fleeing that, rent, that country. Yeah, a lot the, of countries are. In. And they were very wealthy, too. They were very wealthy at one yeah, time. Yeah, Venezuela. Oh, yeah. boy, they had oh, money. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Maybe someday everybody will just be equal, you know. And It'll get better soon. It would be nice if we can just travel anywhere in the world and not worry about. So he's on what? One, two, three, four. Four to what? Four to three. Four to two. It's on the bottom there. Yeah, yeah it's four, four to two. two. The scoreboard's right Oh, I'm up. sorry. Oh, maybe you yeah, you guys are ahead of me. You want me to make it a little bit bigger? No. Be sure. no I was, <laughs> you ain't that old. <laughs> I wasn't looking down there. <laughs> Uh-oh. I just saw him scoring. Well, Joey. <laughs> I'm sorry. Don't take that as a these sly guys, remark. I, I don't are mean any disrespect. This, this is my first time. <laughs> Folks, the scoreboard is about two should, and a half foot long by should, about five that's inches right, wide. Right. And yeah. it's like it's like a two feet from my face. Staring at him. <laughs> Joey's got a decent chance to get it out here. You know, he'll get on the two real good up in the top-hand corner as long yeah. as he doesn't get under the six. He might even draw this above and shoot the two in the yeah, side. Yeah, that might be the safer bet. But then you got to worry about the nine over there also. He, See? Look, under the ooh, six. See it? I yeah. called it. Yeah, he tried you know, to kill I, it. Yeah, I tried to kill it. He tried to bump it maybe. Just go well, into maybe it even. bump yeah. it. Yeah. Right. Just yeah. stop on it. And that's now, a shame. And now he's going to pay. Man, that's going to be. At four to two, that's not good. Sometimes it's tough when you try to hold that stroke back. Yeah. This is when you got to kick with a purpose. <laughs> so what you do is you kick the top of the two ball. Sending the two ball to the left long rail and the cue ball squirting up table around where the eight is. 
and the three. You got those as blockers, but you got to be careful because the flexion, the tangent line coming off of that two ball sends that cue ball right towards the upper left-hand corner. You don't want to just kick this ball just to hit it. Or you kick the bottom of it and send the cue ball down behind the 10 area. Wow, look at that. I would hit this with a little authority, I think. Wow. He kicked the wow. top. Wow, Joey did he, did, he call it? did he call it? Oh, he had to call it. It's oh a cold shot, yeah. God. If you're going to kick, you got to call it. Wow. Nice and look, shot. And look, look what a cue ball was in case he missed. It's a stop position right here. Look at that. Wow. Good for you, Joey. Good That's got to make him feel good. That's a great shot. That's awesome. So I know you guys don't know who I am, but um, I actually make a titanium uh, break cue. All right. Yeah, what I do, I actually put a um, titanium tube inside. I probably work with Paul Drexler. Okay. And um, we actually inserted a titanium tube inside of a shaft for jumping, and it works pretty good. I did it quite a few years ago, and I, I do it once in a while, but I'm it works a, out pretty good. I'm a real good friend of Mike Lambros. And, okay. And I was in the Navy with him in 72. Who, do you know? Athens, Greece. And, no, I'm sorry. And... Uh, and he come out with a tremendous jump cue as well, and it's yeah. really, it's really taking off good for him. So good for him. He's, he's put his heart and soul in it too. As yeah. you, uh oh, he rattled it. Oh my god. Oh, you know, and it's nothing. And, and it was very makeable shot for him. Yeah. Yeah, the and, the key to cues nowadays is you got to make them cheap. You know, they got to they got to be these people buying jump cues for hundred bucks. Here's a something. trivia question yeah. for you. Go ahead. Who made the first jump cue? Oh my god. Uh, if you don't know, don't feel embarrassed. I, even, I didn't know either. I couldn't even guess. That's for me or him? You can answer the question. I think it's Pat Fleming. I, I yeah. believe it was Pat yeah. Fleming. Yeah. yeah, I think it's Pat. And, and yeah. Sammy Jones had something to do with something at one time, too, but I'm not sure. But uh, uh, Pat Fleming, absolutely, yeah. That's yeah. incredible. That, you yeah. know. Pat Fleming screwed up the whole game by jump killing. <laughs> yeah, well, that's what I was saying. There must be a lot of people hating him. <laughs> Pat, if you're listening, we hate you. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, there must be. Uh, Joanna Colbert says the frog. I remember the frog. The frog. Yeah. I oh, yeah, the I'm frog. I have it at home. A little green <laughs> jump cue, yeah. Allison, <laughs> Allison Fisher, I think, was promoting it up in... No, uh, uh, who was it? Oh, I mean, she might have... Allison might have been promoting she it. She was promoting time. it up in Vegas. It was... Uh, yeah, I talked to her on Skype. Uh, oh, my God. Not uh, what... What you gonna call? Was it? The thing about uh, Sammy Jones, I think he just Somebody used... Somebody in the chat used a shaft. Me. I think Sammy Jones uses shaft, I think, or something. Well, yeah, actually, actually, Bruce Bartholet, the, the one that owns the APA. Um, he's on. He's listening. Okay, so Bruce actually has the world record with my with one of my with the shaft. Excuse uh -oh. me, it was Robin. It was Robin Bell. Yeah, Robin Bell. Okay. Oh, right. Yeah, Robin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He got hooked. Robin Dotson now. Yeah, yeah of so all them. They were all. They yeah. were all promoting that. Yeah. Jeanette Lee. They were all doing that at the. Yeah, she used to have a booth at the Super Bowl Expo yes, years ago. Yes, all the time and up in Vegas too. I thought. Boy, you guys are bringing back fond memories. <laughs> Joey just caught a break here. He got hooked behind the nine. Look at oh that. Oh my God, this is crazy. He was out. Wow, this is. It's that's and and at five at four two, Joey didn't need to, to be down three games here. Look at that with safety. Uh, that was Look at that safety. Yeah. Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? Well, he's got a window, but... Uh, There's still but, no makeable yeah, sure. shot. Well, he might bank it. Well, kind of a two-way. You can bank this and play the cue ball behind the nine. If the eight goes in, you yeah. get the nine for a shot. Yeah, it's going to be But make tough. sure you duck the rock. It's actually a natural angle. Is he going to back kick this? Probably going to bank him, though. No? <sighs> Unless he plays safe. Back kick, send it down? Could do that, too. It's straight. Uh, yeah, no, he didn't do safe. that. That's the right shot. Oh, okay. That's the right shot. Yep. Make them work now. Yeah. Also, you would have left the hanging on the yeah, corner pocket. You would have sure. been in trouble. I don't like letting this kid see any ball. <laughs> no, I know. He's yeah. firing at this. Man. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Oh, my God. He's got to hit that hard. Yeah, yeah. The only advantage Joe might have here is the side pocket's a little tight. Right, but look you know. at, yeah. But he it, might play safe. He might go up two rails and put it up in this corner. Yeah, but if he plays a bank, he's going to get on the nine real good. He called yeah. the side pocket. He did. Wow, that's tough. It's a tough angle. Not there, for him. He split, he split the wicket. Oh, my yeah. God. Sammy Jones used a shaft with a fake butt, fake. hollow butt. Oh, yeah, just to cheat it. Then other bit. people followed suit afterwards. Anyone remember the Air Force jump cue? Now we got a very inquisitive bunch of folks watching but 
526 watching. 500, right now. that's awesome. That's awesome. Oh, they're, they're an awesome crew. I'm just very happy that we have this, this kind of tournaments right now. Yeah, it's about time. And the players are just out of this world in here. We that's got Mike a, DeShane in here. It's just, it's just crazy. That's interesting about um, uh, um, Robert Nadella just said about uh, Pete Tascarella. Yeah, making one with Pat right there. Anyway, it's all good. It's uh, except the the jump cues ruined the game. And thanks, you guys. Yeah. Nick a, uh, <laughs> posted a, the link for anyone interested. All right. So oh, uh, my kid. That's my son. Yeah, that's my boy. He was okay. He was on before. Maybe. Yeah, he was on before. He helps me out all the time. Him and my kids. They always promote everything for me. And I got to do the work though. <laughs> Miguel's game is still going on, and that's a. That's oh my been a, God! That's been a, it's been a while. <laughs> <laughs> that's a marathon. But they're having fun. I wonder what what do we have a score on them? No. We used to, but yeah. they're they're over here, folks, just to show you that they're still uh, grinding. Got their antlers tangled up together. Let's get back to Miguel. I mean, let's get back to. Uh, How do you like this Jesus. layout? Oh, it looks like we got a break in the action. Oh, good. Go back to that table. He's got a tough, uh, a, a tough table right here. Wow, that's a long ride. This is no day at the beach right here. No. Just pay attention to the scoreboard. It belongs to the other match. Oh, how'd he hit it? Wow. I, I believe he was the Korean junior champion years ago when I first met him. Wow. Uh, Great little shooter. Lucas is gone. Shooting out of uh, Karam Cafe. Lucas is on. Lucas is not in it, right? He's no, not he's in. not in. No, no. He's, uh, There's somebody he's... asking the chat. All right, folks, we got to get back to the match at hand. There you go. I really wanted to see. Well, you know what? Let's get back to see if he makes the ball. That's some shot. Yeah, he jotted it. He jotted yeah, it. Yeah, I wow. knew it was a tough table, but uh, he didn't. The nine was tougher than that. Yeah, yeah, it really was. Yeah. He got good on that ball. All right, here's, here's the uh, main table here. Uh oh. Well, Joey catches a break right here with a dry break. A nice layout too. Question: the What two, hardest the, tip install? The two to the three is 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 is, is, is his problem here. You mean you wanted you want like a hard Maury like I don't I think I guess your question is what's the hardest tip to install maybe as uh, for Nick. Hardest tip to install? Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Is uh, there a hardest tip? No, mm. well, no. This, this I don't know if they mean. Yeah, like a G10. This, I mean, for breaking or for playing, that's what it comes down yeah, to. Yeah, I'm, I'm not wow. sure of the question. I'm trying to read between yeah. the lines. Nice shot, Joey. Yeah, for, for, for jumping, you know, I mean, for a breaking, there's a lot of phenolics. There's so many phenolics out there right now. Yeah, I have a, a sponsor that actually is on board with the stream, keeps us on the road. Yeah. Uh, he came up with his own concept and. Uh, I gave a few of them out to mm. pros overseas and here in America, yeah. and they said these things should be legal. They break so good. Nice, nice. Unreal. I'd I'm, like to know which ones I, they I, are. I, 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 don't, I don't know the pressure that's put on these things. Uh, they're called high impact tips, H-I, yeah. Im impact tips. And well, they got the pull approved ones now. They're, yeah. they got, well, these guys are on board, and if you buy one tip mm -hmm. during this tournament, you get one free only on as the tournament is in progress nice. after that you uh have to bite too. joey caught yeah, a like bit to, of a break right there i'd like to get some more information on that maybe i can start using them you know um he gave me a bunch of them and i ha and anytime i get merchandise i give it away you know good, to, good. To people online yeah you know people that are chatting people is you know that's actually support what are we doing a, oh let's going airborne here oh god i'm on the wrong joey, camera joey got lucky on the uh, okay there we go joey got lucky uh, uh, on on the leave after i missed the Four ball there. He caught a break. Um, he got bad on the four because he just hit a little too hard. He had to go into it uh, on the three ball. And uh, other, other, otherwise, at five to two, Jay Jesus was going to run away with it. Go ahead. What were you saying? Notice the, the length of the cue ball from the rail. He had to put another extension on his jump cue just to reach it. That's crazy, yeah. The longer I mean, jump cue. Oh, I mean, did he? Yeah. It's probably a Four piece. Yeah. Yeah, this, that's almost a regular shot in that area. And Boston getting, Shorty shooting. Look at that. Look at him. Wow. Oh, man. Wow. He, he didn't only oh, get look caught. what happened. Uh, 
He got <laughs> robbed. Oh my god. Oh my oh, god. Oh, that's just that's the pool gods right there. That's just crazy. That's just awesome shot like that. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, he didn't get rewarded. I mean, he made a beautiful shot. Unfortunate. It's very unfortunate that yeah. happened. Oh, look at him. Close jump he's thinking about. You know. This, well, you this know, is like you're going to need a real short cue for see this See, he's jump. taking the pieces off? Yeah. Took an extension off it? He thinks he's getting over this ball, and he might. I've seen Sammy Guzman jump over the ball with a dollar bill between it. Wow, that's crazy. Come on. I've seen Sammy Guzman jump over a ball with a dollar yeah. bill between them. It's almost like they hit it on the opposite side. <laughs> I gotta, you got to go up like a 90 degree. Y'all. Like you got to be uh, Absolutely. Super, oh, yeah. my God. Yeah. My titanium one could jump. I can jump a, uh, a chalk away, but could not really? that far away. Not that far this, away, though. you got to be closer to the this rail. This would be a hell of a shot right here. Yeah, but, yeah. This, I think he needs more gonna, of an angle. He's, he's going to do it. I know. Yeah, I thought he needed more no, of an angle. No, he needed to come down. It, 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 when you're reaching like that, it's tough. Well, you know what? With Joey ball in hand at 5-2, to two, he needed this right here. Yeah, he definitely needs this. Because at six to two, a race to eight is. That's a tough one. Especially somebody. That... Thank you. Okay. All right, guys. Thank you for having me. Hey, anytime, Nick. Are you long. kidding me? Are yeah, you I'll leaving? Thanks, bro. Nice meeting you. I'll be around. We'll come back okay. after. Good luck, like to you, Like I said, the door. You don't see any doors that you have to no, open. No, I'll come back after. Okay, you guys want anything to drink? You guys good? I'm good. Thank you. I'm good. No. Thanks a million. Pleasure yeah. having you. If you could go clean my car off out there. I, I will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I will. I'd appreciate With it. With a blowtorch, please. <laughs> Actually, it's funny you say that. I have a dual... Um, one of those little blowers yeah, yeah. with a dual battery. Yeah. You can blow that stuff right yeah. up. Make sure you're out there doing <laughs> no. that. That's the way to go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Nick. All right, fellas. Good Thank luck. you. Thanks, right, bro. Bye. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Thanks for sitting in. Another nice guy in the pool world. Three, five. Shut me off. Three, five. Shut me off. Yes, you shut me off. Three, five. Okay. Another nice guy in the pool. Amanda's corrected me. We got into so much stories and talking that Upstate didn't even pay attention. Thank you, man. Oh, my goodness. Come on, Joey. Joey doesn't miss those shots. He didn't. I don't know what he did there, but he had a. Well, you know what? Th there it is right there, Al. He missed a, a shot in the side, and with a little bit of angle, those side pockets are a little bit tighter than the others. Sure. Uh, they don't look bad from here at this angle, but when you're staring down at an angle at them, they're scary. Yeah, I think uh, Mike says, ha, huh, or what? You know, in other words, what? Yeah, Sammy Guzman. Uh, Oh, well, that's not the score. Oh, what? Sammy Guzman, boy. I remember Sammy. What a good kid. Did you just screw me up, Amanda? So I got to bring it back to 5-2 is what you're saying? Uh, Archie Fernandez is saying, Archie Cardona is saying, he's got two, not three. I don't know. Appreciate that, Troy. Thank you, pal. Oh, Amanda was jumping up ahead of the game, I think. Joey's going to have to really bring it now. It's at a 6-2 to two, uh, uh, deficit here. Uh, I, what I was saying was, you know, here we are sitting in uh, West Haven, Connecticut, and never, net, never met Nick Marino. Hey, what a nice guy. Yeah, he is a nice, nice, really, really nice guy. Yeah. Really nice guy. Had his boy listening in there, too. All right, Joey gave him that one. I'm hoping I got the score right. Joey's probably real upset with himself right here at 6-2. Six six two. Two. Man. Look at the coins. I could only see one side of the coins. I can't see them both. Uh, that's the problem. Uh, Mr. Oh, I can't. Oh, no, I could see them right there. Put it back right you there. You can see them? Yeah, yeah. Look right oh, over okay. here. Hold on. See right here? Oh, you can see them. See that? Okay. Okay, right. thanks for that. I was looking at the beads because they have beads over so the I table. So I am right. But they have beads over the table, and I thought they were using that earlier. I never knew to look at the coins. I thought they were using beads. I'm I, I sorry. couldn't see the one on the left. I mean, not that yeah. you pointed out to me. I maybe, can see a tiny piece of it. Maybe yeah. it's out a little bit more than it was before. Nick Marino's a nice guy, unlike the guy to your right. <laughs> I was to his left, so I don't know who you're Troy talking knows about. Where you're sitting, trust maybe me. it was Miguel you were talking about, Troy, you miserable. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> Who's that? Wait a minute. Thanks for having him. And thanks again for all you do. Oh, so this is, oh, same, this must be oh. Junior, Nick A. Marino. Yeah, he, he was in before, he was in before. Oh, yeah. okay. And he, hey. said, he said hi to his dad, that's all. Oh, no, he actually said thanks for having him. Oh, yeah. Good. 
Anytime, Nick. Don't have to mention it at all. Don't ever move out, Nick. <laughs> all right. Joey's back at it. He came up with a dry break, I guess, who's Jesus, who we were watching. Joey's made uh, quite a few errors in this one, and, and he's, the, you know, he actually, uh, it, it dwells on his mind, not as he's playing, but shall he lose this. Uh, he'll talk to me when he calms down, and he, he'll say this ball, that ball, when right. I did this, he, he, you know. The kid's such a grinder, though, you know, he's, Always has he's relentless. And I don't count him out. You know, no, this is no. a winner break format. Uh, I don't like you know, this. But leaf. we are playing. This is a winner break format, and we are playing ten balls. So it's hard to put packages together playing ten ball. But if you should start getting the wins and the breakdown pack, oh, he hit that good. He needed to hit it that good. You know, he, uh, he, he was put a package together. He was going to have trouble getting on the seven if he didn't get where he got. He saved himself right there. Let out the stroke. Joey K. There, nice shot, Joey. If he ever caught a gear, he needs it right here at six to two. The that's next game said. puts puts him on the hill, you know, and that's where the pressure really hits you. That's what I said. Yeah, yeah. He's never out of he it. He got straight on this. He's gonna have to draw this back out too. Yeah, yeah. I don't think he's gonna go forward and play it in the long corner. He's probably gonna draw. Although that's back. doable too, though, right? Yeah, it is doable. Yeah. Automatic position right there. But you got to be comfortable. Shot. Oh, he'll just slide this right. Oh, he's stretching a little bit here. I like the extension on the butt here. Watch your shirt. Watch your shirt. He had the strings on his shirt almost hitting the 10 ball. Wound up you on know top it? of it. It would have been a foul. This is a foul on all balls. His opponent would have to call. Yeah, I know he would. He's going to try to cut this. And at this score, he might not call it. But if it was Hill Hill, I should tell. Uh, maybe somebody should advise Joe. He didn't only try it. to cut it; he cut it in. Joe Koziak now trails by three. I'm not going to tell him, but I think someone should. He doesn't realize he was at the players' meeting. It's six three. He just doesn't realize what's going on with the strings on his sweatshirt. He came real close to the ten. He may have even hit. I don't know, but. Ordered 20 tips? The high impact tips? Oh, good. Hey, thanks, Nikki. Thanks for ordering those, ordering those uh, high impact tips that everybody's starting to install. Appreciate it. I'm sure Joe will appreciate it. Al, you need Mike Casamasima in the booth. I sure do, uh, Neil. You got that right. Er oh. Another dry break. And I don't know if that two goes by the 10. You have an angle for that, Al? Two go by the 10? Yeah, you have the side angle. Uh, oh, you want the side angle? Sure. Uh, he may have a pocket. No, maybe not. Well, where's the one in the cue, boy? He can draw right there where he pointed right, his cue. Right. He's just surmising what's going on here. Yeah, yeah. Paul Lyons. Uh, thank you for your support, Mr. Paul Lyons. Unbelievable. Thank you, Paul. I believe it was Paul. I think it was Paul Lyons that was one of the sponsors when I was down in Carolinas, if I'm not mistaken. And Mr. Castillo, uh -oh. thank you for your support. Brian Carroll, thank you for your support. Hey, thanks, you guys. Al's working his butt off here and uh, if you could watch this Charles. set up for the last two days and and then uh, it almost didn't happen and uh, they made it happen but this guy put everything in it for the last two days so good for you Al only the last two days well that's what I'm saying I'm putting up with you is worse than those two days I want I'm I kidding. want I want a <laughs> refund for the whole weekend <laughs> <laughs> Charles uh, I hope I don't put you the last name Detma thank you for your support is this Cliff Tyler? Wow. I'm pretty sure this is Cliff. I'm pretty sure you, he's undercover. But Cliff, thank you for your support. Joey Appreciate had, it very much. Joey had a weird, nice shot, Joey. You guys are awesome, man. 
Really awesome. Thank you. Don't in, uh, wow, Joey had weird position from the three to the four, and, in, and he chose to take that long shot, and he got there good. He's got to come up for the six here. Now, Mr. Greg Antonakis, if you are listening in, sir, shame on upstate. I'm not loading your graphics up, but I hope you understand what we've been through. I don't know if you've been listening in. With the internet and getting things rewired, it was just brutal. The last thing on my mind, well, the first thing on my mind was to get this internet working. And uh, didn't have a chance to get all the graphics loaded up. In fact, the sponsors that were on board, I didn't get their graphics loaded up until today. It's just been, but I'll make it up to you guys. I'll definitely make it up to you. <coughs> but the, the main sponsors uh, for the tournament... Uh, that are helping out Jason uh, are Perry Q's, Kamui Tips, and Dinosphere, Dinosphere's Balls, uh, which they're playing with here in Jason's room. He's uh, sponsored by them. Uh, you need a bounce here, Joey. Oh, boy. They are playing on Simona's Cloth, recently uh, redone by uh, John, the table mechanic. He needs to stun this out as much as he can here. He's got to pop it. Wow, nice shot, Joey. He popped it really Yeah, he nice. did. He hit that nice. Because he was almost stuck not, right not there. not easy to do on these pockets. No, you know? no. This is tight, tight. Yeah, it's nice. Okay. Well, you know what? He's closing the gap. Uh, hey, Pat. Did somebody say rewired? Pat, you have no clue what we were up against here. Um, the pool room was uh, had old equipment in it. And uh, the only way we can get upgraded bandwidth was to buy a new modem. But to figure all that out, why we were only getting what we're getting after the company said they already upgraded the package to 200 meg down and 200 meg up or whatever it was, uh, we were, it wasn't done. You know, and figured out it was the modem that couldn't handle what was coming through. But anyway, make a long story short, we were on the phone with them since Thursday until, sa until Saturday, about 2 o'clock, and then he finally figured it out. So we went and bought a modem. Seven ball. And a shot on the one. Joey's going to work. He can close the gap right here and get within the game if he can get out right here. He could make it interesting. Yeah. And that, that's what I said a little while ago. You know, it's win a break format. If you can get the breakdown well, and make a ball and get a shot, anything can happen. Yeah. Well, he didn't get the break. He got lucky on the getting kiss in, but he got there. And, and if you, now he's got to get an out, you know. And if you remember a couple of racks ago, Joey broke him so good, but scratched. Uh, so he, he might have found that sweet spot. Uh, oh, see, it seems. And he could put a package on you. you yeah, know. yeah. It seems better than Macy's. It seems Pasquale knows a little bit about this internet stuff. He would have helped you out. He said, if you've been a good here. friend of mine. Oh, good. He's no stranger. He does stuff for mansions. Oh, no kidding. I'm telling you. Yeah, good. good stuff that you never heard of, state-of-the-art stuff. Good for him. That's a nice touch right there. Well, uh, Jesus should not get comfortable here. You did know? the Shane and Shore already play? No, it's the next match. That's the next match, this. yeah. It's the next match after this one here. That should be a real battle. That would be fun to watch. They're all real battles. Yeah, yeah. This, this is, the, like I said, the cream of the crop, you know, in the tournament rises to the top. So from here on in, it's going to be battles. I think Joey's got to stop right here and take that Kang little Lee bit of and uh, Miguel the boy uh, finished yeah. finally, huh? Get off the rail a little bit. They finished? Yeah, they finally finished. Wow, yeah. hard fought over there. They were there for a while. He needs to bounce off the rail here a little bit or go forward. You know what? No, he cheated did that not, little bit. This is a tough table to cheat, you know. Yeah, Guys, if you can help out uh, and spread the word, and I, I'm being quite honest with you, some of my devices that I use for wi on a Wi-Fi basis uh, are not accessible to me right now. If you can share the stream and let everybody know the next match coming up, it would be uh, Mike DeShane and Jason Shaw. I'd appreciate it. I'm kind of in a tough spot right now. Joey caught a little bit of rhythm here, you know, and he sees the he that's, sees the light at the end of the tunnel, like that's type. what 
win a break format will do to you. Right. And he's got a, it's he's, so hard to keep that rhythm in and uh, he, when it's alternating break. And he's got a little bit of swagger in himself now. He's moving good. You know, he's he's comfortable, you know. Just don't let that kid on top of you. Yeah, right. He is, he, he's looking really good. He's because, comfortable. Because uh, you step out of line and... Like Tommy Jr. would say, the boogeyman comes after you. <laughs> he, <laughs> yeah. He hit me with yeah. that last night. I <laughs> I got cramps in my stomach from laughing so hard. He said, here comes the boogeyman. Worthers. Oh, okay. Jason, probably ain't a good time to put up the promotional stuff yet with this game in progress. And maybe. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. My name's being mentioned in here. Joe, Ed stated, loser pays. That's for Ed Ladawi. Vet of State Owl, paying it forward. Great idea. Thanks. Joe Nash. What, what did Ed do? It's on the score, 8 6, I think. It's a bet, is the bet. The final 8 6. I think it's something like that. What am I holding the bet? What am I doing here? You're sharing it with me. <laughs> I don't know what's going on here. Okay. No, no. This was a this was a, a yeah, pay it forward thing to help out uh, Upstate Al. So, um, you know, Nick Marino's son bought twenty tips. So you buy one, and you get one free. So he only had to pay for ten and got twenty tips. That's pretty sharp. That is nice. That's nice. And and we got to really thank Joe for all of that. Uh oh. You know, oh, for he putting got it, it out there. Oh, that's the three. See, now, the colors got me on this. I thought that was the three up top by the seven. The three is the red one. Yeah, up up top by the seven. <laughs> Here's Jason. Can you sit in with us, hey, pal? You need to. Just for a second. What do you need, Jay? Yeah, I got, I got gorilla tape. Oh, look in the background. You can see. Oh, let's go to the other yeah, he camera was just, angle. He was just hooking it up before. There you go. Right there. Jay. Hey. There were no On the TV, man. Yeah, there were do you have this? Do you have I don't black? have the clear one. I got no, the black. Do you have black? Yeah. I just want to make sure that it's Tell my son to get the Gorilla Tape out of my tool bag for you. Okay. Jason and uh, Mario are setting up these posters in the background. Look on He's setting up like a, a, an arena type of thing here. Yeah. He's got some, uh, some banners. They've been all around the room. Yeah, you had them on the wall. Yeah, Everybody, they were just out yeah. of view a little bit. Yeah. yeah. I know you got them all around the room. You can actually see one in the left top corner. I see it. On the other wall. Yeah. You know what? But I like what you're doing there. There's been no surprises with these balls. Nobody, no complaints. Everybody's comfortable with them. You they're know? good balls. They're sure. really nice. They play good. Yeah, good. I like them. Listen, as long as they're round, <laughs> yeah. they got numbers on them, and they're thick <laughs> pockets, I think everybody just, you know, after a while is like, deal with it. Whatever, <laughs> deal with it. Oh, look at. Wow. Look that at opens the door for Joey Korziak to tie this up. I that think that was amazing. Yeah. He made about five, six mistakes, but he, he come alive. Yeah, that's what I mean, but he's playing good. Wait, when you get a chance, Jay, come and sit down with us for a little bit. After, you, after your next match. After you, this guy's been shoveling the snow, cooking 16 dozen eggs. Oh, he's running his butt off. He's yeah. doing everything, man. I and told, playing pool. I told him to go to medical school. It's his own fault. Right, I got to say, with Ed Ludow, he's always coming up with these crazy things. Joe, is it a bet or not? It's foul. What are you drilling up here, man? They, they were just Not trying to get that pay it for to help out you. That's all. sure you're clear on what I was proposing. Okay, let me go back here. i got to see what's going on here. Uh, let me go back here. Nice shot, Joey. Nice position. Ed Perfect. Ladawi, Ed Ladawi. That was real pretty, Joey. Okay, $100 wager. Win slash lose on the next match. Loser pays the streamer. Pay it forward. Uh huh. Tie game. Now I got it. tie game. Sorry, mm -hmm. I'll take care of that. That's all right. Race I'm just to two. Trying to get caught up with what's going on here. Okay. A race to two, folks. So basically, what Ed Ladawi is saying is he's willing to bet a hundred bucks on the next match, and if he wins, he's going to give it to Upstate, the hundred to Upstate. If the person that bets with him wins. They give it to Upstate. I'm in. I'm like in La La Land with this one. I like this one. <laughs> you can't lose. <laughs> oh my God! Wow. You know, it's a nice gesture. Very nice. Yeah, hell yeah. Nice. Yes, it is. 
Very nice. Well, I'm not going to force it on you, but I'll just twist your arm. <laughs> no, no, you guys have fun, man. <laughs> that little, little doll, he's going to get me in trouble. <laughs> All right, here we go. 66. Race to two. Oh. Watch the rock uh, here. Oh, Watch oh, the rock. Oh. The English. Oh, he's okay. Left him a tough shot on his look one at, ball. Look at this break, though. Look at the balls favored the right side of the table. Oh, he made a ball. Oh, I thought he'd come up dry. And believe it or not, it looks like all of them have a pocket, no matter how they're lined up like that. All they all them, got a pocket. All of them but the one to the two. This is tough. This is real tough I'm just right saying here. all the balls have yeah, a pocket. Yeah, right, right. As of right now. Well, how do you, uh, what do you do here? You play safe? What do you do? He might pop this in. Nice try. But, oh, he caught the 10. Well, that, look, that saved him. I don't know if you watched Jesus jump the last jump shot. Not the one where he tapped the top of the eight, but the one prior to that. Right. Oh, yeah, he did well. But but then you got, you He's, still need to get on the two, though. You know, and it's, the problem with this one is that cue ball's got to get down on the felt real quick. Yeah. Because if it touches the rail on the fly, it's going to go right off the table. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, he's, he's got a rail first, maybe. I don't think so. Mm. Mm. You know, if he's got a rail first, he could come around and miss everything. Eh, I'm not calling anything here. He must have it. He's going to play rail first. Look he what he did. He got that window right there. Watch the rock. Yeah. He's okay. Now, now, now the three is funny. The three five combo. Right. Have. Now, mm. not all the balls have a pocket. Yeah, he'll probably take the three five combo. If unless he thinks he no, nah, he's got to take the three five combo. Yeah, the way the cue boy's going to go natural angles here. Unless he can three stop. Rails. If he can stop on a seven, it'd be great. Oh, he's trying to get he's to the short on side. He's stopping on seven. Oh, he got. He did get there. He's getting to the short side, and he didn't get there. It doesn't go past the four over here. It goes, but he didn't get where he wants. In other words, now he has to bump the five, draw back to the rail, and back out for the four, and make sure that the five doesn't interfere with the shot into the corner. Well, he get you the four it? in the side. He could play the four in the side and roll just down. Just bump the five a little bit. Roll down with the five, yeah. Hmm. Unless he can draw back to the rail, and he could shoot the four in that corner. Oh, he went that way. I thought he was going to hit the go into the five, yeah, and, so and, and roll it down. He did good. This, this young man is very impressive. This will put him on. Oh, this wind will put him on the hill first, and now we're well. And I called this from the opening gate. This could turn into a real barn burner. You know, this is. After Joey winning the last one, you know, I'm good for him. He's been grinding the real thing good. About, the thing about Joey, it doesn't matter who he's playing. If he if he can pull his A game out, like he used to, and spark up. Troy, Upstate Al, PM Center. You got a PM Center. Oh, um, I was just, what was I saying? I don't know. Must be, I don't know. About Joey. Joey, yeah. If he gets that spark, and nobody has to like it. None of them. No, 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 no. None of them have to like it. And vice versa, you know. Mm -hmm. He's playing. Uh, these guys are tremendous players. A lot of people say just go forward and roll down. He uses the second rail to slow the cue ball up to get perfect. Yeah, that way you don't get stuck on the rail also. Yep. Okay, Mr. Jesus on the hill first. Seven to six. We're going to eight. We're here at... Uh, let's, uh, let's take these guys off the screen for a little while. And let's go... Over to here. Hope I can do this quickly. And there we go. Right there. US1 Billiards and Bar, West Haven, Connecticut. Main sponsors for the tournament, right there. Perry Cues, Kamui, Dinosphere Balls. Those are the main sponsors for the tournament. They added money, prizes. And you're going to see their uh, banners all around. And. Uh, of course, we have sponsors that keep up us, keep us on the road. Uh, we have to mention them also, and that's why you hear me specify on 
the sponsors. I think the sponsors deserve you gotta play, so play, much air time. you got to play a break. We do. Yes. Let's play a break. All right. So now I can go into the sponsors that are on board here. All right. So let's go here real quick. If I fall asleep, Ed, remind me when they come back, huh? I got you. I'm, I can see There he right. is right here. This came in as we arrived on the 11th hour. Uh, Jerry Breesta, uh, he, he has taught, and I'm going to repeat it, he has taught so many pros through his years on angles in English. It's a three DVD set. You can order yours at thepoolschool.com. And uh, they actually sent us uh, three sets. To, and I, um, I said, send them to Jason and Ara and let them sell them here at the pool room. But get yours right there. It's the brand new 3D DVD set. Uh, you won't regret it. <laughs> I'll tell you that much. I'll tell you a little story about that uh, during the match if I have a chance. Also, here you go right here on your screen. These are the high-impact tips that we're talking about that... Uh, Nick Marino Jr. Uh, actually purchased 20 of them. These are the ones they should. They said they should be illegal. Uh, these things break like lightning hitting a tree. Uh, right there, highimpacttips.com. You buy one, you get one free as long as the tournament is running. So that's uh, highimpacttips.com. This, but is this Nick Marino Jr.? Uh, Oh, okay. Thank you. We Thanks, also got to mention Richard Shue right there. And you get in touch with him. This, this is the latest and the greatest wooden shafts ever been made. They're overbaked, so they're hard as a hard can be. Del Sim is a sponsored player by them, and those are the shafts that he shoots with, plus many other pros, many other amateurs uh, throughout the, uh, the country. Just keep in mind, there might be, I think Dell said, a 10-week wait to get yours. Uh, you can call him right at that phone number, 917-603-6630, or just go to his website, RJH Custom Cues with the S dot com. Thank you, Rich. We wish all the people in the billiard world uh, much success. Ed Ladawi had a question about those high-impact uh, uh, tips on the stream right here. Okay, I, I, well, one second. Let me get uh, over here real quick. Yeah, they're still on break. Uh, the, the gold sponsors on board are azbilliards.com. That you see, Aramith Balls, that's our sponsors that keep us on the road, folks. Uh, Aramith Balls, that's how we roll, only with the best. Uh, Light-systems.com, LED lighting that took the world by storm. JB Cases, everybody knows John Barton and Karen, uh, another gold sponsor, and of course, Simona's Cloth, the best uh, that you can get and lay on any table is Simona's, and Chalky Sticks, I understand Matt is working on two apps right now, always on board with us, good friends, pool world's that small, Joey's back, it looks okay. like we're going back to the action. And uh, what's this? you're missing the score in the bottom. Take bit? it easy. Uh, work with me, baby. Work with me. No, you're sitting beside me. You can see me working on it. Don't be snapping at me on the hill. I'm not snapping at you. Uh, you know, I got a little pressure on me. I'm, I don't mean to snap at you. It's all good. He came up dry here. I know what I got to do. That's all I'm saying. Joey caught a break right here to match to tie it up here with the hill hill. Okay. We get double cheeseburgers, right? Double cheeseburgers. That's what we're looking for right now. Oh, I got to check a PM, uh, right? Got to check a PM from Let's Troy. Let's see where he. Uh, Sorry, Troy. I'll get, I'll get to it right away. Okay, he got nice on the two. <laughs> well, yes, he did. Slide over. Watch that five ball. There you go, Joey. He's got the window between the five and seven here to get up for the four in the side, maybe. Come off that one reel. He might come up perfect for this. It's all speed right here. There's no mo no room for error here uh, you know, with this kid on the hill.
There you go. Hey. All right, now he's got a couple options. He's That's not good. He could thin it and miss the six coming down and then get under the ten and play the five in the side. But, but uh, yeah, he's always thinking about coming off the seven and drawing into the seven and over for the five. Yeah, that's a little... What are we looking at? The he, four to the he, five? The four, yeah, he's got a little funny on it, and he's going to try and draw off the seven and slide over with the draw. How about just going underneath the five? That's and what I thought. Up table. That's what I. See what he did? I thought he could have came straight down. He's got a bank here, though. He's got to make up a bank here. He does. But the, like you said before, these are a little tighter, you know, and there's pressure involved. I don't think he has any choice but to play it. No, man. That didn't work out so good. He didn't sell out. Uh, does the five go by the eight? Can you see? On, on the You're looking at it right there in front of you. Yeah, but is this the best angle to tell? Well, I, I, didn't, I didn't. My usual thing is about four or five cameras around the main table, or at least three. I don't think And it we goes didn't do by. that for a simple reason that he had so many players and we put cameras all over the room, so. You know, it doesn't go past the eight, but he he might be able to stick him on a nine ball. I think I don't think he's I don't think he has the whole ball to stop it. No, he doesn't need the whole ball. He needs like three quarters and keep it behind the nine. Boy, that's that's tough, tough. Well, he's been in tough positions. Yeah. The only thing is, I don't know which way he can cut the five. Can he bank the five around the eight and stick the cue? That's what he's looking at. He, if he can hit it that way and get it the five around the eight. Oh, he's banking it. Ooh, I would send the five to the top Brunswick. Well, where's the six ball? Is that in the here, corner? Down here, I so think. So this yeah. could be a two-way shot. He can go for the bank, and if he hides the cue ball behind the nine, and the five happens to go in, he'll have the shot on a six. If the five doesn't go in, he's safe. You know what? Yeah, there you I, go. He, well, he cheated as much as he could, I guess. I don't think he... Good well, shot. Yeah, yeah. Let that be a lesson. Even if you got three quarters of a ball, you can hit that. Did you see the English he used to yeah, stick it? Yeah, yeah. He hit it well. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, you know, if such a young man to have the experience that he has. Yeah, he hit that really well. I didn't think he could do it. <laughs> You're right, Troy. He's nonstop uh, running. Jason just runs and between food and this and that and... Oh, no, no, no. You know how rough that is to go to around that five yeah, ball going in two rails? That yeah. five ball is the size of a beach ball. I can't believe the cue ball went behind it. But if you ever play three cushion billiards, you come within millimeters away from the second ball you got to hit. It's spooky. Yeah, and you got to give that little bit more of an angle because you're hitting it so firm, too. You know? I, thought he, I thought he would hit it for sure. Right. But at the way he just came in, if he would have hit it, he had a possibility of scratching. Yeah, I mean, he was right behind it. In any case, Jesus is back up and on the hill as Joey Koziak goes back to his seat. This is a B-side match for uh, people. Uh, yeah, the loser will be eliminated. This is this might get a little funny here. I see that. Yeah, I just caught that. He, he it, might have he to won't. go up and down. Right, right. I mean, it, I mean, it's still good. And then he has to contend with the seven on the side. Let's see where he goes here. Look what he did. Oh, he drew okay. back. That's a nice shot. <laughs> and hit it with confidence. Yeah. yeah <laughs> Look yeah. at the size of these pockets. He just fired in and drew back on. Yeah, you know what? It doesn't look bad from here. But when you hit the angle right here, it's like it's scary when you're staring down at it. Even some of the other ones, the bigger tables, it's, it's no picnic. Oh, that's a nice shot. He's right-handed. He's got this. He wants to get that short. Two or three rails. 
most likely three. Yeah, he went to go real short here. Yeah. That's where he called it right there. Nice shot. Start the card, Joey. Good a, on, good match. Man, that's good cold match. No, no, good match. Good yeah, match. Great match. Oh, yeah. No, no disrespect. Thank you. Okay. Jesus Atencio wins that match. Score of 8-6, eliminating Mr. Joey Korsiak. Added a 